last year, but it was it was big. Um, this is their 17th annual uh, big um, symposium with Stanford Excel Partners, big VC firm. Again, this is SiliconANGLE's exclusive coverage of the uh, Stanford Excel Enterprise event. I'm joined with my co-host for this CUBE segment, Jeff Kelly. Jeff Kelly with Wikibon. Jeff, welcome back to uh, Stanford. You were here last year. Uh, I actually didn't make it to this event, this event last year, but uh, happy to be here this year. And as you mentioned, it was all about big data this year. Uh, last year. This year, it's about bringing in uh, the complete kind of uh, modern IT enterprise, modern enterprise and IT infrastructure around big data, cloud, social. So it uh, should be an interesting event. So we are here live in the lobby of the Stanford Alumni Center right in Stanford University. Great campus, sunny day, beautiful. You can see the light coming in, the lights being shifting. So, uh, but the big event here is, is Excel really put together a great program around the future of the enterprise. And Excel is known for all their big consumer investments. Uh, so everyone knows what they did with Facebook. That was a home run beyond all recognition. Anyone could really imagine the success of Facebook that Excel had there. And I saw Jim Breyer earlier and saw some of the Excel partners. You know, they're all kind of spring in their step. However, what people don't know about Excel is that they have huge success in the enterprise. And this program here today that we're going to hear, and you're going to see also stream live on SiliconANGLE, is the enterprise focus. Excel's a new number of investments. They obviously are, uh, we did the early stage investment of Cloudera, the leader in big data, among others. We've got Dropbox, we got uh, Prezi. Microsoft's going to be here as well. So we have a lot of big players here. We're going to try to get the CEO of LinkedIn, uh, Jeff Weiner, who's going to be swinging by. He's going to do a keynote and then get in now and try to grab him. But also, more importantly, Stanford is announcing with Excel a scholar program, an innovation scholar program that's going to be part of this techno Stanford Technology uh, Venture Program. Tom Byers is going to come by with Ping Lee. Um, so a big, great event. Now, Jeff, I want to ask you, um, you looked at the agenda, what do you think this maps into? Obviously, we're covering the cloud, mobile, social in a big way with our big data focus on which you're leading in charge, as well as David Floyd's work around software-led infrastructure. How does this agenda map into uh, Wikibon's research? Mm -hmm. Well, what we're seeing is big data, of course, you know, is a big hot topic and has been for a couple of years now. A lot of the focus has been around uh, some of the interesting things that the web companies are doing, uh, some of the uh, more interesting analytic uh, use cases that we're seeing really forward-looking enterprises use. What we're seeing now is this conversation is starting to shift uh, to the enterprise, and, and particularly what the enterprise can learn from some of the early experiences of the big data pioneers, um, but also you know others in the cloud space as well, and how the two kind of interact. Um, big data provi uh, provides a lot of benefit, but it's also got a lot of requirements uh, if you want to run it at scale in the enterprise. Uh, cloud can help with that. Uh, the modern SLI infrastructure uh, can help with that. So what we're seeing this year and what really maps to this agenda here at the show, uh, it's interesting. As I mentioned, last year was all about big data at this event. Uh, this year it's more about the modern enterprise. Big data, of course, plays an important role uh, in the modern enterprise, but also all about cloud and SLI. So we're seeing the two come together. We're seeing enterprises start to bring these into their environments. Uh, apply some enterprise grade capabilities and uh, really really making this thing uh, big data and these other uh, approaches really hum in the enterprise. So that's kind of uh, uh, what we're seeing out there and it certainly uh, is reflected in I think the, uh, the event this year here at uh, Stanford. Jeff, let me ask you a question. What is your take on the, obviously the big data tsunami we have been covering like a blanket? You were the first analyst to put out the first big data reports. Yvonne is the number one research firm on big data. Um, but big data has a lot of complexity. We're now, what, three good years into what I call the tsunami of big data. I count that fourth year as more of a, a build out year. What has the impact of big data had on infrastructure and software led, it's software defined? Obviously data complexity is a big issue. What have you seen? Well, data complexity is an issue. I think really what the, the impact on the infrastructure specifically is we're seeing in the enterprise a lot of proof of concepts and kind of those early experiments are starting to, the successful ones anyway, are starting to expand into production level deployments. And when you expand, uh, you know, big data deployments into production, you're, you're talking about uh, significant scale, you're talking about uh, adding a lot of uh, hardware, and, and that adds complexity, that adds costs, uh, it's, in terms of actually managing and, and administrating systems like that, uh, it, it, it requires a lot of talent uh, and automation software, and there are a lot of uh, areas that we're starting to see uh, a focus on in the enterprise around big data. Again, specifically around making the best use of the hardware, 
uh, operationalizing and uh, making them run as efficiently as possible, uh, making uh, kind of lowering energy costs, uh, trying to understand how it's going to impact the rest of the organization. So really, once you start to move these big data uh, proof of concepts and early deployments into full-scale production, uh, maybe you're moving uh, to multiple deployments and multiple departments, uh, you've got to really start to consider the impact the hardware has uh, and the infrastructure has, hardware has on the infrastructure of the overall organization. Uh, and of course, um, it, can, it can impact both the bottom line, it can impact operations, performance. Uh, so these are all issues we're seeing the enterprise start to grapple with. Um, and that's only going to become more of an issue uh, as we see uh, more and more enterprises start to really blow out their big data, uh, big data deployments at the production level uh, projects. Okay, this is SiliconANGLE and Wikibon's The Cube, our flagship program. We go out to the events to extract the signal from the noise. Today's a very special event. We're going to hear from obviously all the big time VCs. And the VCs, they're like, uh, you know, they, they carry a big lead foot when they hit the, hit the pavement. Everyone hears the, the earth shatter because they have big money they're investing. But we're also going to hear from not only the VCs, we're going to hear from the big companies. Obviously, Microsoft, we're going to try to get some Facebook guys in here as well, but also the startups. This is Excel. Partners event, so you're going to hear from a lot of their funded startups. Um, so stay here on SiliconAngle.com. One of three channels broadcasting live today. You have all the panels. Go to the Excel Symposium um, sites called StanfordExcel.com, and you'll see the agenda there. Look for the program there, and you can find um, the panel discussions are streaming live, as well as our commentary here at SiliconAngle.com channel two. And of course, on channel one is the Amazon Web Summit, uh, Web Services Summit in San Francisco. All the top developers. So again, all the action bringing to you here at Silicon Angle Wiki Bond exclusively. This is theCUBE, I'm John Furrow, Jeff Kelly. We'll be right back with our next guest after this short break.